he had another plan So he packed up all his things and he moved himself to land And on that very day, a girl named Cat would say Mom, Dad, I want a pet that I'm gonna love He's not a cat or a dog or a frog or a hog He's something different, something special Can we, can we the shark? I want can we, can we the shark? When do we eat? Later, Kenny. Honey, she's talking to that shark again. Mystery of the deep. Watch for things that creep. In the mystery of the deep. Mystery of the deep. Watch for things that creep. In the mystery of the deep. Okay, okay. Oscar, what's going on? The bass sounds terrible. It's just throwing me off not having Trudy here. Well, she'll get here eventually. But in the meantime, we have to practice. The talent competition's on Friday. The School of Sharks will never win if we sound like this. I know, I know. All right! Let's rock! Kenny, you can watch as long as you sit quietly and don't cause any problems. I'm cool, I'm cool. I just want to hear some righteous rock, dude. Okay, let's take it from the chorus. One, two, three, four. Wow. That was nice and loud. I'm sorry, Kenny. I forgot about your super sensitive shark hearing. Try these on. Don't mind if I do. Mystery of the tea. Here. Hey, Trudy. Pick up the sticks and let's rock. Uh, Cat, I need to talk to you. Okay. Can we go outside? Sure. Like, hello, Cat. We are totally sorry to interrupt your rehearsal. Hello, Phoebe. Hello, Phoebe. Hi, Phoebe. What are you all doing here? Oh, my gosh. Didn't Trudy tell you? No. What? Well, Cat, the thing is... Trudy's totally sorry, but she can't be in your little band anymore. What? Don't blame her. She's, like, found a much better band to play with at the talent competition. And what band would that be? The Phoebes? Oh, my gosh. We rock. Totally. And let's face it, your name is awful. Like, really? Who would want to be a bunch of slimy fish? See you at the competition. You'll totally recognize us. We'll be the ones holding the trophy. Come on, little drummer girl. Let's go rehearse. Trudy, how could you do this to us? You know how it is, Cat. The Phoebes are the most popular girls in school. They said if I didn't play with them, I'd never get invited to another birthday party ever again. Trudy! Oh, gotta go. Those Phoebes are pure Evil. Could I eat them for you? That would be so great. But it's probably not such a good idea. Hey, Cat, we've been thinking. Yeah, uh, we don't think we should enter the talent competition. If we quit, the Phoebes have already beaten us. But we don't have a drummer. We're a power trio. There's no way we can win now. It's not about winning. It's about the music. That's the problem. Trudy was our best musician. The music sounds terrible. Take that back. Oh, my gosh! The sharks are attacking each other! <laughs> we just wanted to thank you guys for the totally great drummer you gave us. Oh, my gosh! I didn't think the Phoebes could sound any better. But we do! You'll be sorry for this. Right. Like, sorry all the way to first prize. Cat, I just want to say... Come on, Phoebe! Phoebe? I had to change my name to be in the band. Gotta go. It's no use, Cat. We stink! But let's stink real loud! Do it, Cat! Swing that axe! Yeah!
think so. That sounded great. Yeah. Kenny, that beat you were drumming, can you do it again? I'm not sure. Do what you were doing before. That's it. That's the sound. Keep it up. Look out, Phoebe's. We got a new drummer. Can you move your instrument so I can park my car? But we're a garage band. Well, this is a garage car. Clear out. Mystery of the deep. Watch for things that creep. That sounds good. Except Kenny's getting in the way of my bass solo. You said you'd ask Kenny to play softer during the chorus. I can't hear myself play. She should thank me. Kenny. They call themselves musicians. His drumming is taking over the band. I should have a longer solo. OK, everyone, chill. We've come a long way. Let's not let little things come between us now. I don't care if you've got eight rows of teeth or one. I don't care if you're covered with skin or with scales. Tonight, we're all sharks. Yeah! That's right. Let's do it. Little help. Hello, and welcome to our annual talent competition. Our first place winner will take home this beautiful trophy. And I'm telling you, it's going to be a real competition tonight. You know, I think we got a chance. If we play like we did today... What? No, backstage chum. From now on, it has to be in our contract. Like I thought I smelled fish. We didn't realize how totally desperate you were. Your pet is your new drummer? Just wait till you see it. Kenny's the best drummer ever. Right! And my dog plays the harmonica. See you after we win. Cat, I'm really sorry. It's okay, Trudy. Uh, I mean, Phoebe. I guess I was upset before, but you can play with any band you want to, right? Then you don't mind that I taught them your song? What? You did what? Please welcome the Phoebes! stole our drummer and our song. We don't have a chance. It's okay. We've got a better drummer and a better song. But Kat, we could have quit when the Phoebe stole our drummer, but we didn't. We could have given up after Dad kicked us out of our rehearsal space, but we didn't. And you know what? We're not going to panic now. That was the Phoebes. Weren't they fantastic? Let's see you beat that fish girl. Just watch. I wonder if you got the notion that most of the world is under the ocean. I think the dry land's overrated. Let's take the plunge and go where we originated. Let's all go to the H2O. It's everywhere you see Inside you and me So let's all take a dive Find out why we're alive Swim in the deep blue sea Go Sharks! Oh my gosh! They're like good I think we know who our winner is. 
Let's have a big hand for the School of Sharks! Zombo's Fright Night. Oh, yeah. Ghosts. I'm so scared. What the? Someone forgot to pay the electric bill. What's going on? Who's there? I saw a ghost! Kenny, there's no such thing as ghosts. I know! Except for this one. Were you watching the Fright Night Marathon again? Yeah, but it wasn't that. Can I stay in here tonight? Please, Cat, can I please? Okay, Kenny, just don't hug the <laughs> covers. Good morning. Uh, it'd be a better morning if Kenny hadn't woken us up last night. Oh, sorry. What has gotten into him? He must have been scared by the wind or something. Boy, for a fearless predator, he's pretty chicken. You're lucky I don't like the taste of balding vegetarians. I'm beat. I hear that. Ah! Kenny, what are you doing? I'm spending the night in here with you. You weren't going to leave me all alone with the ghost, were you? Kenny, there's no ghost. It's all in your imagination. You're probably right. It's just, I'd hate to wake up Mom and Dad again and get you in all kinds of trouble. You know how they can be. Fine, Kenny. You can stay in here tonight, but this can't go on forever. Right. Just till the ghost leaves. Cat! Cat! Huh? Sorry to bother you, but could you go grab me some more minnow snacks? I'd go myself, but... I don't want to run into you-know-who. You woke me up to ask me that? Is that bad? Right. Sorry. Maybe if I'm nice and quiet. Just getting some snacks. Don't want any trouble. Huh? Leave this house. What the... Whoops. Wrong room. Breakfast, Kenny. I can't believe Mom and Dad are making me eat outside. I got feelings, you know. If you don't stop this nonsense with the ghost, you're going to spend the rest of your life out here. It's not nonsense. That ghost is real. Well, what are we going to do about this, Kenny? I know. When I was watching Fright Night, there was this movie where a ghost was haunting these kids. So they held a seance. They found out why the ghost was haunting them, and after that, he left them alone. Kenny, you can't believe everything you see on TV. Come on, Cat. Couldn't we just give it a try? Okay, if it'll make you feel better. Okay, Kenny, you ready to do this? I think so. Good. Now remember, one knock means no, two means yes. Concentrate as hard as you can. We are seeking the spirit who roams this house. Come, spirit, and communicate with us. Ah! Are you there, spirit? Very funny, Kenny. It wasn't me. Spirit, why do you haunt 
this house. Kenny. What about Kenny? He ate my leg. Is that true? I never ate anyone's leg. At least not that I know of. What do you mean, not that you know of? I've eaten a lot of stuff in my life. You ate my leg. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I'm a nice shark. You ruined my life, and now I will ruin yours. Spirit, isn't there something we can do to put your soul at rest? Yes. Kenny must go back to the ocean and never come near a human being again. Spirit, wait! I'll go pack a bag. World's best predator. I remember when Cat got me this. Good times. Kenny, this is crazy. You can't leave. You heard what the ghost said, Cat. I know, but you belong here with me. Why should we let that ghost tell us what to do? Because we don't want to get him mad. You're not just going to leave here forever without a fight, are you? That was my plan. Huh. Maybe Dad was right about you. What do you mean? When he called you a chicken. Now, wait just a minute. So, you're in? In what? You and I are going to do some ghost busting. <sighs> Okay, you got everything? Yep. Good. Now remember, it's important not to show fear, because ghosts feed on fear. No fear. Fear is bad. Okay, let's do this. Spirit, are you in this house? We seek to communicate with you. Ah! He's here. <laughs> Great. Kenny, why are you still here? I told you to leave this house! Okay, Kenny, now! Throw the salt! Be gone, spirit! Take a hike! <laughs> Where'd you get that brilliant idea? From the internet? Kenny, water! Now you're making me angry! It was her idea! Be gone, spirit! You're a genius! <laughs> Kenny. Kenny. Ah! Someone! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Hey, look what fell on my head. It looks like some kind of video projector. Kenny, I think I know who our ghost is. Who? Burton Plush Toy the Third. You mean that bratty rich kid who's always trying to kidnap me? Yeah, I guess he thought if he could scare you out of the house, he could finally capture you. Whoa, good thing we stood up to him then. <laughs> we? Okay, you. Well, some things are worth fighting for. You're right, Cat. Sometimes even things that aren't food. Excuse me, sir. Your warm milk. Set it down here, Merkins. Very good, sir. Merkins, I'm very cross with you. Why did you have to fall out of that tree? I'm sorry, sir, but the shark was shaking it quite vigorously. We were so close, Merkins. Well, I'm not through yet. Someday that shark will be mine. Yes, sir. Will you be requiring a bedtime story? Not tonight. I'm in no mood. Very good, sir. Good 
night, then. Ha, 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 ha. 